The first cargo of liquefied natural gas recently departed the APLNG facility we constructed and operate on Curtis Island, Australia. The facility is one of the world's first projects to convert coal seam gas to liquefied natural gas. Natural gas emits 50% fewer greenhouse gases than coal, delivering a cleaner, greener, sustainable energy source. This two-train facility was designed to incorporate a number of leading environmental practices, including the use of equipment and processes that reduce the need to flare and also reduce flaring volumes. Flaring is the essential safety practice of burning off excess gases which may be released during startup and shutdown, ship loading, or abnormal process conditions. The only alternative to flaring would be to vent gases into the atmosphere, which could create safety and environmental hazards in the facility. So occasionally we need to flare. But we've worked to implement flaring practices that have the least impact on the environment while still serving this critical safety function. At APLNG, the facility's characteristics made ground flaring a good fit. Our ground flare design burns more cleanly than the conventional elevated pipe flare and results in fewer greenhouse gas emissions overall. Ground flares are shielded by an enclosure, making the flare less visible than elevated pipe flares. Designed to be smokeless under specified operating conditions, the ground flares are a leading design for emissions management and for reducing aesthetic impact and light disturbance to local communities. The reduced light also lessens the potential impact on marine mammals and turtles and their subsequent nesting and breeding behaviors. We designed, constructed, and continue to operate APLNG with a focus on sustainable practices. We're working to find solutions that benefit communities, the environment, and the company, both now and into the future.